So it's not quite a full windup, but not quite just strictly pitching out of the stretch. 2-0 pitch. Martin swings. It's a high fly ball. Deep left center field. Back goes Kelly Dugan. Back through the wall. And this ball is gone. Kyle Martin with a towering home run that just clears the fence in left center field. And the Gold Eyes take a 1-0 lead just three batters into the game. On 2-0, Martin popped one high and deep into the air. And it just clears the big fence. And for Kyle Martin, it's his 11th home run of the season. So a quick start for the Winnipeg Gold Eyes trying to snap a nine-game losing streak. And the Gold Eyes are on the board first. And the pitch. Swing and a fly ball. Deep left field looking up Maroney. And this ball is gone. Joey Terdoslovich chucks a two-run homer to left. And just like that, the Dogs have taken a two-to-one lead in the bottom half of the first inning. Terdoslovich is 13th home run of the year. Two-to-one Chicago in the bottom of the first. 1-0 pitch, hit in the air, deep left field, that's gone. Tyler Latendorf for the grand slam home run to left. And the Dogs lead it 6-1 to one in the bottom half of the first. Here's the 1-1 pitch. Breaking ball. High. Fly ball to right. Pretty deep. Back goes Logan Hill on the warning track, and it's gone. <laughs> Kelly Dugan with a solo home run to right. Ladendorf and Dugan have gone back-to-back, and it's 7-1 Chicago in the bottom half of the first. Here's the 2-1 pitch. Hit in the air, deep left field, forget it. Tyler Ladendorf hits his second home run of the night well beyond the concourse and left. And it's 8-1 Chicago in the bottom half of the third. In the first place... Here's Wes Starbell, swings, lines in the left center field. That ball's going to drop in for a base hit. Maroney digs for the plate. No throw home by Kraus. Maroney scores standing up. Wes Starbell with an RBI single to left center. And the Gold Eyes cut the dogs lead at 8-2 to two in the top half of the fourth inning. Lamson deals, line drive, shallow left field, racing forward. Maroney dies and makes the catch. What a play by Jonathan Maroney. Laid out and slides across the outfield grass in shallow left center and takes away a base hit from Victor Roach. Amazing catch by Jonathan Maroney. That's as good a play as we've seen in the outfield all year around the American Association. The first pitch popped up right side. Might be playable for Hobson into foul ground. Hobson stretching, and did he get it? And he makes the catch, leaning over the tarp. Great play by Casey Hobson. Bumped into the tarp and stretched towards the first row of stands to end the at-bat for Jordan George. A 1-1, high, fly ball deep to left field. Dugan going back. He's at the wall, and it's gone! Kyle Martin with his second home run of the night. A three-run opposite field shot out of the concourse and left. And that'll pull the gold eyes with an 8-5 here in the top half of the seventh. So two homers and four runs batted in for Kyle Martin tonight. And the 2-1. Line drive out to left, moving over Dugan. He's not going to get it. It's down for a base hit, bouncing off the wall. Darvel rounds 30, scores. George will get to third standing up. Kevin Lachance with an RBI double down the left field line. It's now 8-6 to six Chicago. One on and one out. 3-2 and a high fly ball to left center. Almadova racing back towards the warning track near the wall. Leaping! And it's gone! <laughs> Kelly Dugan with his second home run of the night. A two-run shot the other way to left center field. 2-2 pitch, swing and a miss. He struck him out of the changeup. And the ball game is over. Paul Schwindel with his scoreless ninth. 
and the Chicago Dogs take the opener of this series. Thanks. Winnipeg Gold Eyes by a final score of 10 to 6.